How's it going guys? We are back with another video here and this is an interesting video to make. It's kind of just like a tip video and it is how to complete the Joe Sackick the fastest. So pretty much right now as you guys can see I'm only 182 out of 200 and you need a lot more than that. You need 500 sets to get the final 94 overall Joe Sack. And that's the way it should be. 94 overall cards should not be simple to get. So pretty much what I suggest to you guys is do all the sets you possibly can at all times. So the ones that I usually always do, and I always bank five, at least, at least four a day, uh, always are the trade-in sets. So here we go, player upgrades. So I always bank these ones in. The bronze to silver, silver commons to silver rare. That's the most simple ones I find, at least. I, even the silver rares are pretty common. The way I look at it, you're going to keep getting these cards over and over and over again. As you keep, complain, keep playing competitive seasons, uh, you will be getting silver cards, bronze cards. These first three should really not be a problem. These, the gold commons to gold rare player can be a little tricky, I'm not going to lie. Because you may have to buy them on the market, and that's it can cost you a nice amount because non gold rares do go for a good amount. But uh, most of the time, you're gonna have gold rare players available for re roll. And uh, I just want to let you guys know something I have not spent any money on the game this year. Truth is, guys, you really don't need to spend money on this game to have a very good team. Again, I have 528k in the bank right now, I got a solid team. I, I really, you don't need to spend much money. You really don't. This is my team right here, and I have spent zero dollars on the game. Zero dollars. And I have not even gotten a lot of packs from like EA or anything like that. Like, like I said, I'll tell you one thing, guys. I have not had a pull in a pack that I could sell for over 50k. I think you know, most I've I pulled out of a pack is 50k, and that's one card. And everybody else is 10k or less. I have not pulled any crazy cards this year and I have not spent any money so like I said you really don't need to spend money to have a very good team trust me I've played a ton of games so that def that definitely makes it a little different but um overall you really don't need to spend money so don't feel like you have to just you know you need the sets or anything like that you really don't but another thing I suggest here with the sets though is the Gatorade sets these are simple sets to do. You gotta just do your challenges. You put all these sets in. That's nine sets right there. That's a solid amount right there. And uh, like I said, just try to do as many sets as you possibly can. The team building sets, if you can do them, just do them. Just do them. Do every set that's possibly available to you. Um, also, legend sets, if you can do that. Uh, the hot tips, if you haven't done that already. There's two of them, I believe. He has to do these two. You should have 15 and then one. I mean, it's... You really work with what you have. I mean, at the end of the day, some people are going to take longer than others. But if you did, say like five per day. If you do five per day, you're probably going to be in good shape at the end of the day. So, you know, you'll be good. Do the monthly reward sets. Just try to do as many sets as possible. I know I've been saying it. But like I said, if you do all the sets, you're going to be in good shape. And, uh, yeah, that's all you want to do in the end is just try to get that Joe Sackick. It looks like a sick card. I played against someone that actually had it today, and he just killed me. So many, so many good goals with him. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, a, it's a card you want, probably. But, uh, yeah, I mean, that's all I really got to say today about the Joe Sackick. I mean, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like. Subscribe if you are new here. I really appreciate all the support on my latest videos. It really means a lot to me. Getting so close, so close to 7,000 subscribers. Tell all your friends, tell all your family about my channel. I definitely would appreciate it as I definitely get much, much closer to a milestone on my channel I'm very proud of. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.